Hello everyone. In this video, I'll be demonstrating how do we do the multiplication sum that we you can see in front of you right now. The numbers are 248 multiplied by 25. Okay, so 25 is our multiplier and uh, 248 is our multiplicand. So as we all know, the standard procedure says we uh, first select the rod from where will our answer will start or the work on our answer will start. So it's a three digit number multiplied by two digit number. So total digits in play are five digits. So the answer on our abacus will start from the fifth rod. Okay, so I mean the work will start from the fifth rod. So this was the fifth rod. We'll start working from this rod. This is our units place. So first rod, second rod, third rod, fourth rod, and fifth rod. Okay, so fifth rod will start working from. Uh, the first pro steps to be done is we'll take the tens place digit of the multiplier which is 2 multiply it with each of the digits of 248 okay so we'll start with 2 multiplied by 2 2 multiplied by 2 is 0 4 so 0 on this rod and 4 on the next rod remember whenever we multiply a one digit number with another one digit number in case of multiplication on abacus we have to always consider the answer as a two digit answer whenever we get a one digit answer we have to prefix it with a zero so in this case two multiplied by two will be considered as zero four so zero on this rod four on the next rod okay now for the next step we'll move one step for one rod further and then multiply two with four two four or two multiplied by four is 0 8 so 0 on this rod 8 on the next rod again we'll move one rod further and then multiply the 2 with 8 2 multiplied by 8 gives us 16 so 16 will have to be added from here so 1 on this rod and 6 on the next rod okay so the first part of the calculation where we multiplied each of the digits of 248 with the tens place digit 2 is done now we'll take the units place digit 5 from the multiplier and multiply with each of the digits of 248. In this case, we'll start from the fourth rod instead of the fifth rod. Whenever we are considering multiplying it with the tens place digit, we started from the fifth rod. Now when we are starting uh, multiplying e with the units place digit, we'll start from the fourth rod. Okay, so 5 multiplied by 2 gives us 10 so the units plus 5 of the multiplier multiplied with the hundreds place digit of the multiplicand is 5 multiplied by 2 5 multiplied by 2 is 10 so we'll add 10 from this rod so 1 on this rod will have to be added so plus 5 minus 4 and 0 on the next rod so nothing to be done there then we'll move one rod further and then multiply 5 with 4 5 multiplied by 4 is 20. So we'll have to add 20 from this rod. So to add 2 on this rod, we'll have to do the we'll use the big friend formula, which is minus 8 and plus 10 and 0 on the next rod. So nothing to be done on that rod. Then we'll again move one rod further and multiply 5 with 8. 5 multiplied by 8 is 40 so we'll have to add 40 on this rod so 4 to be added on this rod 0 on the next 4 to be added on the zero, uh, this rod will be done using its big friend formula which is minus 6 and plus 10 and 0 on the next rod so nothing to be done there so the final answer that we have after multiplying 248 with 25 is 6200 so in this case even if we when we multiplied a three digit number with another two digit number the we started working from the fifth rod but the final answer that we have got is a four digit answer and not a five digit answer so the only thing to we need to ensure is that we, every time whenever we multiply a one digit number with another one digit number we have to consider a two digit answer okay by mistake if a student uh, considers it as a one digit answer and uses it on the abacus then his answer is bound to go wrong in most cases okay so three digit multiplied by two digit can give us a four digit answer or a five digit answer depending on the size of the digits in either of the numbers okay so this in this case the answer is 6200 I hope this uh, procedure helps everyone and in case of any more difficulties please do please do 
मेंशन इट इन द कॉमेंट सेक्शन आई ट्राई एंड एड्रेस दैम इन अपकमिंग वीडियो थैंक यू